Hello ladies and gentlemen, what is up guys? It is your host, the one only Prexels, and today guys, I'm making this video for you guys because uh, certain people on my friends list and certain people um, I know have been trying to contact me about, um, they've been fished the same exact way as I did, and uh, they've been asking me questions on like, how do I, um, how to do the support ticket, how to long the steam ticket to respond to you, how to avoid future stuff, pretty much guys, um, Whatever you do, don't join a team speak that asks you to download anything, including a sound driver. Someone ever asks you, do you want to join a tournament? Please th take a moment and think of your think inside your head. Do you really think somebody, a higher skill level, possibly on Supreme or Global, is going to ask a Silver to play in a tournament with them? Or whatever rank you are. So, I don't think anyone is, no Global Elite is probably going to, no offense to the Silvers out there, but no Global Elite is going to want a Silver to play in a tournament with them. So be realistic. Don't get scammed. Like, try your best not to accept friend requests that you don't know. At least click the person's uh, profile. If it's private, just don't even accept it. If it's public, look and see if you have any friends in common. If you don't, don't accept it. And if you do have friends in common, contact your friend and ask the person why does he want to add you to his friends list. And then you can go. You can deal with it from there on. But don't click any fishy links. Don't um join random team speaks that you don't know. And if you join a team speak and if they ask you to download something. Don't do it because it's most likely a key logger or a rat. And the first step is, in order to find a key logger or on your PC or something, is by looking at your startup. Um, a while ago when I had the virus on my PC or whatever the hell I had, um, it was around in the startup menu. I have Windows 8, as you can see right here, Windows 8. But uh, pretty much um, for Windows 8, what you have to do is like go to the startup. Or if you have Windows 7, just type misconfig or whatever. And then you'll see like the programs in the startup. For me, the virus was like around here. It was like some weird name listed below and you couldn't find it anywhere. But I always check my processes every once in a while to see if anything suspicious is running in the background. But I'm fine. Nothing's running in the background. So that's okay. Uh, second of all, um, don't accept random firm requests that you do absolutely do not know. Like, I can show you my whole, I can show you my pending firm requests and you do not want to see them. But okay, let's see what we can do from here. Friends, they're all the way up here. Is there a way I can like check my friend? Here's all my friend requests right here. I normally don't accept any friend requests unless you comment on my profile why you want to be my friend or something. But if you don't comment on my profile, I'm just gonna let your, I'm just gonna have your friend requests just sitting here all day. I'm not gonna accept it or anything like that. But yeah, these are all my friend requests. You try adding me on your profile, you're getting error adding friend or whatever majiggy. But so blah 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 blah, whatever like that. Um. <laughs> Actually, guys, I'm gonna show you the guy who actually fished. Oh uh, man, I can't, I can't switch Steam accounts because it is crap. Since I'm actually running in Steam, um, here's a support ticket I actually made for Steam. Um, Friday, July 26th is when I got fished. Let me go to my uh, inventory. Show you that I still have the items there. Um, where's my uh, inventory arino? There goes my inventory arino. I have all my items still. You can see I have everything. I have everything here. Everything. Blah 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 blah. Blah. All right, let me show you my uh, inventory history, cause people have been saying that they don't believe me that um that I actually did get fished, that I'm just making it up to scam Steam, which is not true. So here we go. The first day I got scammed. I uh, this is for the giveaway for someone who won a knife. But uh, the first day I got scammed was right over here. All my items went to this bot, and this bot right here, 13 days ago, I believe that's the time I got fished. I'm not too 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 sure, but uh yeah, this is where all my items went the first time. And then the second half of my items went to this bot right here, which is like right over here, 24 days ago, which is I pretty much I believe I got fished that day, 24 days ago. And then my second half of items, like my uh, when I got my items back from Steam Support, I traded them to a, a a dupe account or whatever the fuck it's called, like a you know a little bot account for myself, so my items can be safe there. I ended up getting them back. I went to sleep, woke up in the morning, and all this was sent to this bot right here. Pretty sure this guy's fished another, fished a couple people since he has all these fudging red lines in his inventory like holy shrimp but um let me show you guys my support ticket this is my ticket i sent my steam i sent steam my eyes are still let me get it back blah 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 if your eyes are blah blah i show i pro provided screenshots like over here let me open up all these screenshots so you guys can see it when you provide screenshots here's the one step you have to do you always always have to include your account username right here in this case mine is supernova977 you always have to include it in your account username up here um always include it Always include it and they'll be able to help you and assist you from there on. Uh, this is my screenshot, blah, blah, blah. This says, a one-time customer gesture. We have reversed the trades that were committed on your account, blah, blah, blah. That was stolen, blah, blah, blah. And they were not reversed. They were not restored stolen items again. Okay, there we go. I got my, all my items back. I went to sleep, woke back up. 
I had contact Steam support saying all my items were fished uh, again. And then uh, they contact me again and they say your account security appears to have been compromised. You must do the following to ensure the account is secure before it is enabled again. Blah, 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 did all that. I factory reset my PC, getting my account back, blah, 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 blah. I sent all these screenshots to them. This is the type of error you're going to get if you try to join the TeamSpeak. You're going to get this error. You don't have the latest TeamSpeak sound driver. Click here to install. You click it. You download a Google Doc. Run it. Uh, Steam will change or whatever. The EXE will change. And your account's pretty much fucked from there on. So don't make that mistake that I did. Here's my uh, trade history screenshots. Blah, blah, blah. All my trade history screenshots. I got a, uh, Steam support. Er, alert from Steam support. Uh, market history. Dude. The dude freaking... Sold my Doppler for 260. You know what's really like the, the the thing that really pissed me off when the hijacker got my account is this crap right here. If I can show you guys, the dude bought a 321 dollar Desert Eagle mutter, well worn, and it's not even like field tested, minimal wear factor. It just had to be well worn. You know what I'm saying? You could have at least got me factory and you a souvenir, but no, no, no. You want to be all that cheap and you want to get me a Desert Eagle mutter, well worn. Okay. He uh, sold it for that. He he bought it for three twenty one on my account. Um, all this market history. I woke up. Blah blah blah. Shares your account may have been compromised. Blah blah. They sent a uh, password reset to my email. And um, blah, blah blah. And it says right here, if you're missing items and gifts on your account, please reply to the ticket with a screenshot of your trade history outline here. Uh, I submitted a ticket. I showed the screenshots, and they gave back my items a second time. Um, shit. Well, pretty much. Yeah, that's that. Uh, this course, it took me like around maybe like a week for Steam to respond to me. July 1st, July 26th, that was like around six days. So they all, they responded to me. So it took them a while. It took them not that long to respond to me and get all my items back sorted out. So I'm thankful for Steam. So there's some tips for you guys to stay out of scamming. And TeamSpeak is the latest scam that you guys should be aware about. Until next time, guys, I am Prex Styles. Peace out.